in an unlikely duo of U.S. congressmen teaming up in a push to let states legalize, regulate, tax, and control marijuana without federal interference. CNBC's Eamon Jabbers uh, joins us uh, from Washington uh, with the details. We've talked about it uh, a few times already. We're playing a lot of dead uh, and as we go to break and, and come back. Um, a little Cypress Hill coming up uh, as we go to break with you. Um, can you do it with a straight face? Uh, I can do it with a straight face, Joe, but I'm going to have fish tunes playing in my head the whole time go. we do That's this. Cool. Right? Did you just have a Snickers bar or something? <laughs> no, 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 I'm fine. We drug tested this company, Joe. I'm clean. I, I want you to know that. Got in, uh, I got in before that, <laughs> yeah, 20 years ago. <laughs> right. I, I can never leave. I can never <laughs> Just kidding. Go ahead. Well let, me, uh, well, let me walk you through here what this bill would do to start with. Take a look at some of the bullet points here, and you get a sense of where we are with this bill. Starting with uh, letting states legalize, uh, regulate, tax, and control marijuana without federal interference. That's the key here. They're saying this isn't a legalization bill. It's a bill that would allow the states to do it. It would also limit the federal marijuana rule to cross-border or interstate smuggling only, and it would allow people to legally grow, use, or sell marijuana in states where it is legal. Now, we caught up with Congressman Ron Paul last night, and he told us that to him, this is just a matter of the Constitution of the United States and basic American finance. Take a listen. Our prisons are loaded with, with uh, people who deal in, uh, have been involved in usage of, of uh, drugs. We have 5% of the population in the world. We have 25% of the prisoners. And mo many of them are related to the, to, the, to the drug issue. So there are so many arguments against uh, that will support my position that the drug war is a failure. It's a waste of a lot of money. Now, Joe, to be sure, we should say that just because these two congressmen are introducing this bill doesn't mean it's going to become law anytime soon. Remember, we've got a Republican House of Representatives up here on Capitol Hill. That makes it unlikely that this thing will pass, but the marijuana legalization groups are touting it as a historic first step in the war against the drug war. And I've been thinking about what the CNBC angle on this is, and I wonder if you guys have some thoughts on what dr uh, marijuana legalization would do to commodity prices. I've got to imagine that growing marijuana is a lot more profitable than growing corn and other the things. Biggest, a lot of farmers would switch out, right? They start trading. It's by far the biggest cash oh, crop. The, the, right. It's the biggest cash crop in, in the country. And I will tell you that our very highest rated documentaries that we've yep. ever had were about pot. And I've, I've never been able to figure out why, but I mean just four or five times the numbers that, that, that we get. I and mean, we still run them, in fact. Um, but I think or do we still run them? The person who did them left. I don't know whether we do. But if you're looking for the trade here, I think corn prices go up because everybody gets the munchies, right? Exactly. Corn price. I, I don't know <laughs> what. Wait, what could, so marijuana go. would come 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 way down. Right. Right. It yeah. would. Would, it, would you trade marijuana on the CME? sugar? I guess they would, would you trade, right? Would you trade futures contracts? Cannabis? Yeah, you would. Why not? Right. Why not? Right. If it's the biggest sure. cash crop in America. Yeah, I mean, look, there's money to be made here. And, and the serious point here, guys, is that the states are really in financial crisis. Exactly. And this bill would allow the states to tax marijuana. We know that the marijuana trade is going on right now. Yep. This would bring that into the daylight, Billions. allow the states to tax it. California estimated it would be as much as a billion dollars a year in taxes. That state needs the money. A lot of these states might be looking at this in a different light this year, guys. All right. Thank serious you. Serious money. Yeah. No, absolutely. It's a thousand million. So the need for revenue has never been greater. No uh -huh. doubt about that. Uh, Eamon Jarvis joining us from uh, D.C. All right. Uh, up next.